prosecutor came to me and the prosecutor come and she said, Mr. Irving, my sister foolishness go on. Mr. Irving, my sister foolishness go on. You all they need to do, just appeal the case. When you go to prison, just appeal it. You have to win your case. When you go to prison, you must appeal your case. Really? When you go to prison, you must appeal your case. Why not do it now? Why not prevent me from going to prison? Do your job now and prevent me from going to prison for a crime that I did not commit. You clearly see that I did not do the crime. Because you said it yourself. But then you're telling me to go to prison and do some time. And then appeal the case. Man, get the fuck out of my face. The system messed up. It, it, it messed, messed up. up. Overall, it messed up. Yeah, man. It messed up, man. Messed it, you know, I'm nobody for, for, for back here. So, all right, you know, so I'm going right. to investigate this. Okay. There's no investigation done to say, all right, let me see if him actually do this. Them say him do it. Let me see if him actually do it. Right. right? There was no proper no, investigation. No proper investigation. Went into it. The evidence that they took, there was no, they did not, um, care for the evidence in the proper way because i mean for a crime like that right the first lawyer even though he did not do much he said all right for proof say innocent just do a dna i must say no problem coming no i'm not go there so right just do a dna i did the dna and my dna was done they took a sample from the girl right and my understanding is that they the police waited 14 days before they sent in the girl's DNA. So what was the purpose of requesting the DNA test? What was the purpose? Anyway, watch this. This is where the dressing up of the different characters come in play. Because each of these characters are a vital part of the justice system. So let us look at it. The victim behind bars. Sometimes the person who set out to be the victim is not necessarily the victim. And vice versa, the offender. But this is why the justice system is in place. To root out and separate the weed from the grass. And in doing so, the second character comes in play, the judge. The judge is a vital element of the criminal justice system. One of the role of the judge is to determine whether the evidence that the parties want to use is illegal or improper. Now, according to my understanding, she never even considered the evidence that were brought into this case. In truth and in fact, if she did, then the requesting of the DNA test suggested by Mr. Irving's lawyer would have most likely showed that Mr. Irving hadn't done what the girl was saying he did. Now, the final character, a police officer. Earlier I said the police force is a key cornerstone in the justice system. Reason being, it all started from the police and their investigation team. Now, if they don't execute their jobs properly, then the ones who are responsible for crimes and violence are not going to be punished the way they are supposed to be. My personal view, I think that Mr. Irving was another innocent who suffered the brutal hands of the criminal justice system of Jamaica, like many others.